Greetings, friends and family. My name is Pastor William. Today we'll be sitting in with Katang M. Um, he's a musician, he is a keyboardist, um, he's a writer, um, he's a musical director. So Katang is a man who, who, who is in love with one thing, which is music. And there's nothing that can take him away from the love of music. So um, we'll be sitting in with him today so that he can inspire those that are in love with music or that love singing um, and that can actually sing, of course, and that want to live according to that passion, maybe host concerts like he does and um, as well as um, um, event coordination as he does. So we, we want to, he wants to encourage, inspire those people so that they can live up to their dreams and be able to let their passions feed them. So today we are talking with Katang. Um, yes, the next time we'll be talking about something different. Every week we try to talk about something different. Um, last week we were sitting in with, of course, PN, um, the awesome lady who was interviewing me. Um, and we're talking about something different. We're talking about writing and everything, uh, everything else like that. But, but uh, uh, this week we are talking about music because there's something that we realized. There is someone, somehow, some way, who is singing in spite of um, working or studying. So people have a passion for music and they love singing and that's what they love doing. And now we want to inspire and motivate them to be able to live according to their passion and actually let their passion feed them. So Mr. Katang M, how are you doing, sir? I'm, I'm good, sir. You're doing good. How's your day going so far? It's very well. Uh, mine is, is, is very well. Okay, um, usually when I get people coming so that I can interview them and get to know them, I, I put myself in the shoes of the people that are watching because people want to get to know you and understand who you are and where you're from. But before we get there, just for two seconds, I just want to understand why Ketang M. Um, what, what is the M for? Maybe musical director, musical magician, you know, people want to know because um, I came across a lady who, she has a name as well, she has a particular Mpo M for instance. Yeah, I know her from church, so I, I want to get to know uh, why, why Katang M, what's, what's so special with the M? Is it, is it a spiritual name or what's happening? <laughs> no, no, just to put it simple, uh, Katang M stands for, the M stands for my surname, okay. at, the M, at the same time, the M stands for musician. Oh, okay. So it's Ketang Mulefe, Ketang Oh, okay. So yeah. it speaks about who you are. Yes. That's, that's very interesting because some of us are thinking to ourselves while well, we're sitting at home and watching this yeah. video, um, we're asking ourselves, who is this guy? What makes him so special that he deserves an interview? Um, what makes him so special that we need to call him up or maybe sit down and look at him, you know, and watch his, his story? So tell us about yourself, like where you come from and why you do what you do. What, what inspires you um, in terms of music? So can you please tell us about that? Okay, Khitang uh, M is a boy from Togoza. I was born here in Togoza. Uh, my parents, it's Bishop Mulefe. Uh, sure. So, yeah. PK. <laughs> yeah. So, Khitang uh, M is just a simple guy. Yeah, he loves being versatile uh, in everything. I, I don't just do music, I do a lot of things. But most thing, the main thing, it's music. So, Khetang is more about music. If you hear the name Khetang, just know that there's music coming. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But um, I, I, I get that, and I, I get a lot of musicians that I came across with. Um, but I, I, I want to know, what is it that you actually do when it comes to music? Because um, I know you went to school for music, right? Yeah. So, I, I want to know, what is it that you, that, you, that you do when it comes to music? Okay. Uh. To name a few, uh, I'm a musician. Yes. Uh, uh, I'm a pianist. I'm a drama, uh, I'm a producer, I'm a music director, and I'm a music programmer. Okay. And a songwriter. Okay. Yeah, so that's what I do in music. Okay. Yeah. I thought ITs are the only ones that deal with programming. What's, what's this music program? <laughs> okay, well, uh, some people they sometimes uh, confuse producing and programming. Okay. So, in about programming, uh, you deal most about creating sounds. Okay. Yeah, and beats and all that some drum acoustics and all that. Okay. Yeah. That's interesting. So what, what type of music, before we get into what type of music are you producing, what type of music do you listen to? Uh, 
Uh, okay, because I work with a lot of musicians and not just gospel. I listen to gospel mostly mm. and I do jazz, I do soul, Afro pop, I do house, I do hip hop sometimes. So okay. that's the kind of music I listen to. And, and what you listen to influences your, your style of writing, of course. Yes. Okay, so what type of music do you produce now? Okay, uh, now I'm, I'm busy producing with the, 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 this type of music, which is Afro pop. Okay. Yeah, because I have two artists which I'm managing and okay. I'm producing for them. Okay. So I'm, I'm busy with Afro pop for now. Oh, Afro pop. Yeah. I have no idea what that is. Some of us, that's why we are pastors and writers. <laughs> we don't understand. But, but um, that's very interesting. So, since we, how many songs have you written so far? When it comes to, if you were to think back, since you said, okay, I want to be a musician. Yeah. How many songs have you written so far? Quite a lot, because uh, some of them, they, they are being sang around the same. Okay. Yeah, uh, I can say more than 100. More than 100? Yeah, more than 100. So. Yo, so you've been in the game for, for quite some time. Yeah. How, how many years would you say? Uh, oh, I started when I was six, so okay. I can say... Probably 20. 20. Yeah. Sure. Sure. That's that's very interesting. So I'm um, just quickly just to go out of um, out of my questions. What would you say to someone who just started? Um, maybe he wants to get into the whole idea of music, writing, and and playing, and all that. How would you encourage them to just keep on holding on, or or so that they can get to the fullness of their career? Okay. What people need to know that uh, music is not easy. Mm. And don't think that with just one performance and you are the best artist. Mm. You need to work hard and accept all the criticism you get from people. Okay. Then everything you have to wash out. Okay. No, that's great. That's great. Yeah. So, in other words, keep on, keep on pressing, keep on yeah. pushing. Uh, that's interesting. So, since we're talking about keep on pressing and keep on pushing, when are you going to over release an, an album? Okay. Uh, for now, mm. uh, I won't release an album. Okay. I'll release a singer. Mm. Uh, for an album, I'm still working on something because I don't want to give out something that will just be there for two minutes, but I want to give out something that will stay and encourage people okay. out there and encourage young musicians. Okay. Yes. Okay. So, um, okay. No, that's 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 very interesting. So your your main aim is to encourage people, yes. no matter the style of music that you are producing. You want someone to get inspired wherever they are. Yes. You want them to do something with their lives. Yes. No, that's that's very interesting because that's all that we are all about. Inspire TV. We want to inspire people so that they can get up and and do something with their lives because we believe that passions that we have yes. can actually feed us if you just put more time and more effort in in them. Um, just lastly, um, well, we will be talking to you about uh, hosting concerts and everything like that. But just quickly, when it comes to um, event coordinating, what is it that you do? Uh, I forgot to say that I'm an event planner too. Okay. <clears throat> so I organize most of the things when it comes to events, uh, and mostly events I do is more of festivals, not okay. just gospel festivals, okay. even secular music festivals. Okay. So what I can say, uh, mostly on, 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 on event coordinating, I deal with music. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm holding the, the department of music okay. and all other things, just few things. So you always are you? Would you say your life is always on stage? Maybe every Saturday or? Yeah, not just on, uh, mostly on stage because I do camera, okay. like photography, and videography. So. Oh, a man with many talents. Yeah. <laughs> so most of the time it's camera, and the other time it's music. Okay. But mostly it's camera. It's camera. Yeah. All of it. Okay. Now that's interesting. So do you have uh, any person that you would play for that you play for who is um, maybe? Uh, famous or playing for someone or singing or whatever uh, okay on gospel mm. I don't have anyone I play for on okay. gospel but on secular music I play for Malum Cool Cat okay yeah he's a hip hop artist okay yeah we started back in December okay yeah so do you plan on growing with these guys do they like find you somewhere when you are performing or I, I don't know they, is there an application that you fill up you know no uh, what happened is they heard from a friend oh, okay. that there's a musician who can play hip hop live. Oh, okay. So that's the connection. Okay. Yeah, that, that's how it went. Okay. Because they just went, wanted to see me. Yeah. 
but then I, I showed them how I play and all that. Awesome. Then they were like, so okay. you would say to, to people that they should keep on pushing their talent and yeah. money will follow them? Yeah. Yeah, we want money. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is Katang M and please don't go anywhere. We're still going to be talking in our second session and finding out more about Mr. Katang M. Khatang M presents Into Worship to be held on the 27th of April 2018 at IAG Cornerstone Assembly in Tokoza. Tickets are only sold at 100 Rand per person. For more info, please call 078-671-3917 or 074-277-8857. Welcome back. We are still sitting with Khatang M, the lyrical genius, the, the man of the music. Um, just, just quickly, how would you motivate people um, when it comes to um, the struggles that they will face in music? Maybe people taking advantage of, of them when it comes to payments and all those things. Because I know that people go through those problems. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So how would you encourage them? Um, how, how should they go about the issue of payments maybe before or after stage? Okay. Uh, what musicians should do is just be independent. The second thing is have a contract. Mm -hmm. No matter what, have a contract as a musician, a drama, a, a pianist, bassist, lead guitarist, a singer. You need to have a contract that you give to your client and say, okay, since you say I should come to play, this is my contract. Mm -hmm. And this is the agreement we have that I'm getting the money before this time. Okay? See? And another thing, uh, some musicians have a problem about. Uh, people eating their royalties and all that just know that when you write your music go to Sabra and register okay okay yeah okay no, that's 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 great because there are so many people that that are interested in music but they haven't went to school you know some of them they maybe they started uh, they studied to be a doctor or anything and they have a passion of music but they don't know how to go about pricings and yeah. you know um, so when it comes to being a backup singer is there like a standard fee um, that people charge yeah. Oh, okay. It depends. Uh. Uh, for for the ones I always work with, mm. the standard fee it's mostly one point five. Oh, okay. Upwards. Yeah. Okay. Yo. So that's a standard fee. Yeah. So someone can make a living out of this. Yes. Okay. Um. Just just quickly. Um. Tell us about your your six months plan, because I know that you have a, a concert coming along. Can you tell us a bit about that concert? What's your plan and the feel of music? You know? Okay. Um, oh, okay, the concert is on the 27th April. Mm -hmm. So we're bringing something new, something fresh. Okay. At the same time, much more. Okay. So it's going to be youthful mm -hmm. and, be, and be very vibey, but we bring that maturity on it. Okay. So we're trying to give people a new thing. Like they don't, they don't have to, to strictly stay and say gospel music should be like this. Okay. We're just giving people idea that gospel music can go this way. Okay. So yeah, it's going to be more skillful and uh, maturity on it. Okay. Yeah. So who do you have on your on your uh, on your band? You know, the, your your singers. Who do you have on your lineup? Oh, uh, okay. Firstly, on lineup, uh, I'm featuring some someone, some lady. Called Katie, okay, and I'm featuring Pian Jaga, okay, and Linda Lai, okay. Uh, then on the band, I have Dumi, so I have Dumi on bass, I have Vusi on guitar, I have Isaac on keys, okay, and it's myself on piano, okay, and singing. Then on backing, it's Pel Nguli, Pian Jaga, Gadego, uh, Lerato, and Linda Lai. Okay, so wh where is this event going to take place? We Curious. We want to get people um, supporting our South African, especially um, township people that they don't notice. Yeah. You know, there's so many um, talents in, in, in the township, but people don't get noticed. So, how, where, where is this concert, and when, where can they get tickets? You know. Okay. The concert is at Togoza IAG Cornerstone, for Togoza, and you can get tickets by just contacting us on 078. 671-3917 just to repeat it it's 078-671-3917 that's where you can get tickets okay and i know that ig cornerstone is just um front opposite with motlodi primary school yes so um 
please let us support. When, when, when is the date again? 27 April. 27 April. Please let us support. Buy your tickets now yes. because we're intending for people to support us and we'll be there as well. We'll be taking pictures, we'll be taking selfies. You know, you check up on our uh, on our Facebook page. What, what's your Facebook page again? It's Khetang M. Khetang M. Um, check out uh, our pictures on Khetang M. We'll be taking selfies and also on our uh, our page as well. I am William. You you'll find us there. Maybe being streaming live so that we can show you what our, our South African talent is, is is all about. So um, tell us about your six months plan. Okay. We, we are interested in knowing about what you'll be doing the next couple of weeks. You know, so that we can inspire people that they can actually do something with their lives. They can actually get up, maybe get some gigs. You know how they get some gigs, you know, and all of that. Okay, uh, my six month six months plan now. Uh, it's more about focusing on my two artists, which are doing Afro pop, uh, because I want uh, one of them is going to release now on March. Okay. So our plan is it's pushing them. Okay. Yeah, my plan is pushing them and making sure that they will know out there. Okay. And another plan is more on on on, on media, camera wise. I'll be working on some new drama mm. that's coming, so watch out for it. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So, what are you doing um, 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 this weekend? What are you doing? What? what where are? We, where are you? Where can we find you? Okay. I have Bumalanga. I have. Okay. It's not gospel gigs. Okay. I have. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're following you. We wanna know what you're doing. <laughs> okay. No problem. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I have Bumalanga. I have Skaleni. I have Indabila. I have Tabu. Yes. Then I have uh, church on Sunday mm -hmm. morning, which is IAG Cornerstone. Yes. Then after there, I'm going to uh, what's this church? Again? Forgiveness. Okay. Yeah, Forgiveness Ministries, which is at Sluma. Okay. I'll be performing there. Okay. So how can we? Um, okay, we're going to get you on on Katang M. Are we going to find all these details like flyers, pictures, telling us where yes. you are and what you're doing? Yes. You're okay. Doing that is so great. Um, we need to support our South African talent because it's very imperative. Um, so many people who are talented are stuck um, with their insecurities because they believe that no one is going to support them. So if we can get um, a couple of people, um, you know what, I believe that South Africa can actually rise when it comes to music. Yeah. Just that we're still stuck with, with all the oldies, you know, yeah. the golden oldies. We, it's an, we are unable to notice the new flavors that are being added and I believe that this is a new flavor that we're seeing today and um, we, we have to support him. So now um, please just go on, on his page um, Khetang M and just press like and press follow and just follow what he's doing and when he's doing it and be there not for anything else but for him. Um, let's become fans of our um, musicians, especially in, we are in Togoza now, so especially in Togoza, let's become fans, let's support them, and let us be uh, there uh, for them. Um, again, can we just share about the tickets, how we can get the tickets so that they can know um, where to go? Okay, uh, for tickets, uh, you just need to contact 078-671-3917. You can WhatsApp us or call us, mm -hmm. it will depend on you. Mm. And I guess you can also send a message if you're facing some challenge or you forgot the number, you can get, um, you can send a message on their Khetang M um, page and they will respond, of course. Thank you so much for joining us for this second session. Um, please stay um, so that we can um, know more about Khetang M in our third session. Thank you so much. Khetang M presents Into Worship to be held on the 27th of April 2018. IAG Cornerstone Assembly in Tomorrow. Tickets are only sold at 100 Rand per person. For more info, please call 078 671 3917 or 074 277 8857. Thank you so much for joining us wherever you are. You are welcome this evening. Um, I know you've been busy, but then we are still sitting down with Khetang M. And I I've been wondering uh, before we went to the break that how can people get to know your music if you don't hit us with the note nyana, you know, so that people can hear you sing, you know? Okay. Um, can you hit us with, with, with something? Just a verse or a chorus? Okay, so let's say. <clears throat> don't give up on God, cause he won't give up on you. Oh, don't give up on God, cause he won't give up on you. He's able. He's able. He's able. 
the trick. I don't know. Okay, all right. Yeah, you need to follow this man. Um, where can people find you? Like Facebook, emails, um, numbers. Maybe someone wants to get married to you next week. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> so where, where can people find you? No, you can get me on Facebook. Uh, for Facebook page, it's Khetang M. Khetang M. Yeah, and for if you wanna be my friend on Facebook, then just say Khetang Tumelo Mulif. Khetang Tumelo Mulif. Okay, any numbers? Uh, you can get me on 078-671-3917. Okay, ladies, you heard that. Um, we're not sure if it's single, but yeah. <laughs> we just thank you so much for um, staying in with us, sitting in with sure. us. Um, um, hopefully, we'll um, get to see you being live, you know, yeah. and hopefully we'll get to see you on YouTube, yeah. iTunes, you know, yeah. being everywhere. Yeah. Um, so we, we, when are you, are you planning to get onto iTunes? Um, very soon, very soon, because I'm planning to release one single this year. Mm. Yeah, around, after my show, by the way. Okay. Yeah, so around May, June, I'll be releasing a single. Okay. Yes. So you'll be releasing just a single, just not, a single. not a whole CD. Not a whole CD, okay. just a single. Okay, greatness. This is Khetang M. Please follow him on his page, is Khetang M. Yes. Right? So please follow him and please connect with him so that we can support our, um, especially township stars. You know, it's, it's, it's inspiring to find people from um, the township who are doing something with our lives, who are letting their patients actually feed them. And um, today we sat down with Khetang M and it's inspiring to hear his story and hear um, about his love of music. And yeah, next week we'll be sitting in with um, Tepang um, Manyaka, a motivational speaker from Cape Town. Um, but we'll be meeting up with him at um, Mamelodi. So please, um, thank you.